Illinois students at Weekoggin High School voted seniors Brandy Johnson and Lupe Silva the cutest couple. So the self-proclaimed lesbians get their picture in the yearbook under the cute banner. At first, school officials tried to ban the category, but finally relented despite a parental objection. Joining us on from Chicago with reaction, Dr. Laura Berman, who teaches psychiatry at Northwestern University. Now, I'm saying this with all due respect to these two 17-year-old girls. I, I don't want to sound mean, condescending, or all that. I want to give you the thing. I believe, based upon our investigation of this Weekoggin High School deal and the picture, and put up the picture again of these, of these students, that the kids voted the this couple the cutest couple to tweak the adults doctor to cause trouble to make an issue mm -hmm. of the yearbook now this happens as a former high school teacher i can tell you every school every sure. semester that's what's in play here in my opinion what do you say you know yes kids like to tweak the adults and like to be provocative and all of that is true i don't think that this is necessarily completely about them trying to tweak the adults and trying to be provocative. I think this is about, and we've seen this in other high schools as well, it's starting to become at least a small trend, if not a large one, that homosexuality is becoming, thankfully, more normalized because this is the time in adolescence that kids are exploring their sexuality and, in fact, starting to identify what their sexual orientation now, you realize, is. And you realize that you said, thankfully, that I don't know, 50, 60 percent of the country is going to be angry with you for saying that. And here's why. <laughs> you know, oh, don't laugh. You've got to respect their I point know. of view. I as, as, do. Look, I as do. a I'm medical doctor and a psychiatrist, you have to respect their right. point of view because it is a valid point of view. And let me tell you what let's the point see. of view is. What is the point of view? I'll all tell right. you if it's valid. High school kids experiment. They experiment all over the place. High school kids, sure. a lot of them are rebellious. They have a chip on their shoulder. They'll do things, as I said, I think this is one of the examples, just to get a reaction, just to rebel. A lot of parents sure. say, listen, we don't want to normalize homosexuality in a public way in an academic setting, high school, among mm -hmm. minors. We don't think that reflects Why? how we feel about it. Well for a number of reasons. One, social. It's much more difficult to be a homosexual than a heterosexual in America. Two, religious. There are people who believe that that uh, kind of a sure. lifestyle is against their religion and they pass that on to sure. their children. Three, an exposition of sexuality in a minor, and that's very important, in a minor situation is inappropriate in an academic setting. All of those things are valid, doctor, and they shouldn't be sure. condescended to. But the, but we're not talking. You're, all of those things may be valid in certain populations, but we're not. We're not. What you, where you're getting stuck is assuming that validating or acknowledging homosexuality as a reality is somehow going to make homosexuality more likely to happen. And what we do know is that homosexual teens are four times more likely to be seriously bullied, two times more likely than heterosexual kids to be significantly involved in drugs and alcohol and abuse drugs and alcohol, and six times more likely than heterosexual teens to have suicidal attempts. And so it's a huge at-risk population. Yes, there is experimentation, absolutely. But it's also very true that many teens are becoming very clear that they are seriously attracted to the same sex, not the opposite sex, and they have well, nowhere they, to think, turn. Um, they have uh, no look, support I've, I've been very consistent on this since my first book was written. I think private behavior belongs in private settings. Right. I don't think it belongs in the high school but you'd be book. okay. you'd be okay with a cutest couple, heterosexual couple, I would though. be because that is the norm of society. See, it's the same gay marriage thing. You have a 6% option here. Uh, homosexuals, according to research, are 6% of the population. And but if since minority, since... What? But since African Americans are a minority, would you have a problem with an African American heterosexual no, because couple as because the Because race, race is not conduct. There's a difference between who you are and what you do, and that is another. So you're key judging. Guess. You're judging homosexuality. Not judging. As I'm not judging conduct. anybody at anything. I'm telling you that there's a legitimate point of view that number one. You don't allow sexuality to intrude in your high school yearbook because right. they're this minors. Isn't, this isn't about sexuality. Sure, this it is. is just a this couple. is a lesbian couple that was voted in but there they're not, because but they're, they're not a lesbian couple. Their, but they're not flaunting their sexuality. How do you know? They're just in love. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. In the picture, How do they're you not know they're not? You don't they're know not that. Flaunting, they're not flaunting their sexuality any more or any less than a heterosexual Look, couple doctor, their age. There's mind. no reason why Brandy and Lupe had to declare themselves anything other than friends.
They didn't have to do that. They if chose to do love, it. But they're do they have the same right to do that as any heterosexual. It's not a matter. It's does. a matter of appropriateness. That's what it's a matter of. And see, look, but you're, you're passing, dismissing you're all. Of, look, I'm not. Look, judgment. I don't want any kid to be bullied. I wrote Kids Are Americans too for gay kids who are getting bullied. They should read mm -hmm. the book to know their rights. I don't want anything like that to happen. But you're right. dismissing a very legitimate point. This is inappropriate. You do not define yourself in a high school Only yearbook if you judge in a sexual way. Is wrong. Period. And you it's don't not do it. Wrong. These kids, these kids need support, and they need to. Well, know then that let them go okay to a support to group are. run by you. It doesn't need to be. <laughs> Here I am. You know, and you don't have to take out posters and put them on your front lawn. Because they're supporting all, all the other kids that are stuck. Well, that's your extrapolation we'll of. Safer. That's your extrapolation. Somebody else would say you're encouraging that kind of experimentation you when you don't have to it. do it. It happens anyway. All right, doctor. But that's the old argument. <laughs> Let's legalize drugs because it happens anyway. You've got to be boundaries. Drugs are not the same. Dr homosexuality is not no, legal. It, but it, you know what I'm talking about. Um, and it shouldn't be. All right. Illegal. Always great to talk with you, by the way. Very good debate. <laughs> you too.